Uh, hi, I had a request from a comment for somebody asking me to show this bow closer up. This is my um, Nuwali Bows Korean Hybrid, the long version of their Korean bow um, that is kind of a, it's not really totally Korean, it's also got some elements of tartar bows, especially in the narrow um, arrow pass grip area, um, along with, I think they said, the uh, semi-static tips of the Korean bows and the uh, bending casting section of tartar bows. Um, so it's got a lot of recurve. This one has both the painted horn effect. This is a you know synthetic horn substitute um, with wood and uh, glass laminate and then uh, extra paid extra to have the birch bark cover on the front. It's basically a bunch of three inch segments of birch bark. Glued along, looks real nice. Um, and I've been very happy with it. So this one is um, 54 pounds at 28 inches and about 70 pounds at 32, um, which is what I often draw. Um, I bought this one because it's longer and accommodates up to a 34 inch draw, giving me a lot of options for playing with different draw techniques that I don't usually work with, you know, even out with some of the Manchu stuff. Um, so strong, just like that. Birch bark is the horn effect. Um, I really like the, the shape on these tips is really good on the string compared to some of my other bows. Lays in there real nice. Um, this is the Nualni Korean hybrid long version. This one cost about 660 euros in total with the, the, the fact of the extra cost for the birch bark. Um, I think I got the horn effect for free because it was already on this one when he was selling it. Um, might be a bit more to get that. All right, let me know if you have any other questions about it.